Sasa tuna wadi yangu hii kama Uzo meka didi te arafu wata uki exit uzo uata. Ah, una sa ona. Can you see Paru on the other side of eastern part of the swamp? Roger. Okay, Roger. For the last 38 years, uh, this park experienced um, a very unique uh, scenario, whereby we we have uh, an elephant giving two twins. Uh, I mean twins, and then and then this time again around. Um, that was 19, 1980, and this time again round, we had a Paru giving birth again twins. This is a very unique scenario in terms of conservation, particularly in the elephant, uh, uh, elephant, elephant populations. So we, 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 we are really proud and we are now monitoring and we are ensuring that uh, the, the babies are quite in, in good uh, health. Also our vets are monitoring uh, and the ecological monitoring um, system are put in place to ensure that uh, this mother is well safe and always um, monitoring when it goes outside, we also monitor it. There are two twins, and then there is another younger younger sister moving alongside with them. This means that um, it takes care also when the mother is also grazing uh, or browsing. Then the, the young, the young, the other young sister takes care of the, the two twins. You can see them moving together, three in three. I, I think you have seen them moving in th there are three. So the, there's a big one, the big one, uh, the big one, and then the, the two twins. We study behavior of the elephants, and we know by names the all elephants in Amboseli. There are 1,658 family units. Talking about family, family consists of uh, cousins, grandmothers, sisters. They stay together the rest of their life. Uh, and the, the oldest female, she's the boss of the family. Otherwise, there's no papa in family. The males leave the family when they are 10 to 15 years old. That's a near me. trying to establish the number of wildlife species, the big mammals that we have in the ecosystem. Uh, because as we have heard from our chief scientist here, it is not possible to manage what we cannot count, what we cannot measure. So the objective today is to establish the number of the big animals that we have in this ecosystem so that we can be able to establish um, the, 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 the management strategies. We want to know how many are in the parks, 
how many are outside the park. When they move out of the park, there is quite a lot of uh, human wildlife interaction, and we also need to manage that. So we are doing an ecosystem-wide uh, area count uh, because that is the most uh, comprehensive uh, kind of count that uh, we are able to do. It's expensive, but it is important.